hi everybody welcome to my robotic channel so today we are going to discuss about the how we define the robot home position in fanuc robot or you can also say it the reference position with respect to fanuc robot language so first of all we make the one program i as you see here the select uh, i make one program naming uh, robot home so i take one point uh, there that position i have to make uh, home position so you can see the position these are the joint values you can write uh, by taking pen or paper these joint values j1 j2 j3 j4 j5 j5 j6 and three so now how we define uh, this uh, position as a home position so let's we start the video uh, first of all we have to select the menu key and as you see uh, there is uh, six number setup and uh, we go to next page by pressing this right key next setup page there is fifth number reference position in fanuc we are uh, defining home with respect to reference position so select the reference position by making enter so reference position it's having the too many reference position you can able to make uh, these numbers uh, of reference position so we take the first one so there is one option is the detail i press the f3 key detail first one uh, reference position number 1 and first option is there comment so you what uh, you want to write in comment you write can uh, there by pressing the enter using the upper case i am right here i use this position as a home so i write here home you are able to see how i write uh, if i want to take now p o so m n o i have to press this f key f3 key three times first m second time n third time i press it's coming to o so then i have to select this right next and i have to press there s enter now in that way we are able to write the name so i write the home position so uh, enable disable uh, we make it enable later it's a valid home you make it true and uh, which number signal you want to define do number digital output number i want to make seven number okay so uh, when uh, it's a process going to be completed so that time the do number seven uh, will be on if robot uh, reaching our home position so now you can see item number 7 digital input output it's a uh, i already write the signal command name robot home position it's uh, now is on off in off condition so we are going uh, to again the same process in uh, reference position so i write here and uh, now you write the position J1, J2, J3 axis value by pressing the numeric key. 23 minus 30. Like that, you can able to write the each and every axis value. Or one simple procedure is there: record. If you are robot is standing now at the time of one position which you want to make it home, so it's a simple. You press the record. Uh, generally, record is not possible. You see, uh, press the shift key. to record so you have to press the shift and then record it take the automatically the current position so these are the now current position so you are uh, able uh, this uh, this side you can see the plus minus 1 1 1 1 is everywhere so this is called the tolerance uh, when the robot comes near to this uh, axis position a uh, plus minus 1 that time it's make the do number 7 on as you can see uh, now i make it uh, enable by pressing the f4 key enable yes and press the preview you can see here uh, the enable first one is enable and the comment you can see is the true and uh, now you can see the output number 7
is going to be on. Whenever the robot uh, coming near to this position, plus minus 1 mm, it will uh, make this DO automatically on and when leaving this home position, it will become automatically off. And uh, I will, okay, you can see practically when you are doing, because you now I am, one more thing I want to uh, discuss in this video. Sometimes when you are pressing this uh, IO key, input or output key is there and uh, they are showing some different type of uh, uh, window you see this type of window so you are not able to identify which is the do input output so here is one option you are able to see the type uh, these type of input outputs are there i will discuss in further uh, upcoming video so you have to select uh, digital digital input output so this is the output window and here the input output this is the input di digital inputs are there and I press this, this is the digital output are there. You can select, you can watch whatever you want to, which number you want to watch. So you can also by select here the item key function. Item. I write here 48 and enter. It's directly jumped to 48. So thanks. Now this process is complete. Thanks for watching my video.